lost my best friend to 23 She left her body and hovered above me What's up guys, Indian Sense here. Welcome back to the episode of Ninja Voltage. So, today is like I have an off day today from work. So, and some people told me that we have some leaks, right? For Naruto and Hashirama. Also, Tobi Rama is also coming, but I'm not sure about the Tutsune and stuff. But yeah, he is coming. So, but these two, Naruto Kid and Hashirama V1 Rekit apparently is gonna be the next roundup mostly just like we had Madara and Sasuke boy right it's gonna be pretty game so what I am trying to do today is just you know trying to figure out what the jutsu is actually gonna look like and I will try to recreate the jutsu in Ninja Storm 4 and see maybe we will find something relevant to this information and shout out to the people who told me that leaks are here so here this one is Kazuaki from my guild and one more I guess this is one of my subscribers so he also sent me some details that in his guild discord there were some leaks or something right so I don't have the original source but yeah it is what it is yeah so these this is the art we have for Naruto like art is looking dope as usual art never disappoints this one is also good okay and so we are gonna have four four cards for naruto boy because he is a pretty uh, he's gonna be a new unit right so i'm i'm assuming this is the ultimate uh, from the description this is probably gonna be the limit break and these two are gonna be the uh three star four star right rm jutsu and mm, this kind of, kind of a shadow clone jutsu and we have Hashirama with only 3 cards because we already have a kit for it. So this is probably the X ultimate. I don't know what's gonna do. This is something, he punches something into the ground and this is the shurikens, I think. Shadow shurikens, something. Okay, now it's time for Naruto. So this is gonna be the 4 star. Equip this card to able to activate the Jutsu Shadow Clone Jutsu summon an army of Shadow Clones to deal damage. Okay. This is, we all know Harim Jutsu, it's probably gonna do paralysis or something. Uh, this is the limit break, yeah. Equip this card to your activate Demon Fox Fluke and will like yourself a Demon Fox and deal damage to enemies around you. I hope this is something good as like covers Naruto and Demon Cloak, the Fox Cloak and he runs around. For some time, at least 2-3 seconds, so that's gonna be pretty good if that's the case. And this is the normal Rasengar, I'm pretty sure nothing fancy about it. Equip this card to be able to activate the extra damage to Rasengan and leave the Rasengan and deal massive damage. So it's it can be similar to Sasuke. Sasuke boy basically like he will uh, activate the Rasengan and go forward and use the Rasengan. If that's the case, then it's gonna be pretty much same as Sasuke boy. Yeah. So what I will do now is I will try to basically find these Jutsus in uh, Naruto Ninja Storm 4. And try to see if I can get some understanding of how it's gonna be. Also, like uh, today is what fifth, right? And we got all out mission on thirtieth. So I believe on Tuesday or Monday we are gonna have the new roundup. So we have five six days. Anyways, okay, let's do this. Uh, I will record something on Naruto Ninja Storm Four and try to find these juices, right?
Okay, so it gives us card to able to activate ninjutsu, wood style, ruptured earth, pound the earth and deal damage in a wide area. Okay, it's pretty much the same as Sonade or Sakura, I think. And this is the X Ultimate. Equip this card to able to activate the X Ultimate Jutsu Wood Style Wooden Dummy Jutsu Charge Attack. Come on, a wooden golem to charge and cause massive damage. So I think it will go dash forward and do something. We'll have to see. Not sure. Right? We already saw this one. This one, I don't know what does this one do. Ninja card power to be in number two. Probably some kind of shadow show you can do. Get guys that was pretty much it for this video and hope you find this useful and I just did this today because I have some time so I thought why not make a video on leaks I don't if you are a long term subscriber to my channel you know that I don't really do leaks videos to this date I have made two or three leaks video that's it but yeah so yeah that's pretty much it for this video I hope you found something useful and maybe we will have, we will see good kits because in reality we can only say for sure what it's gonna look like when Bandai releases in the game, right? We can only speculate at this point of time, like it's, it's probably gonna look like this, right? So yeah, thanks for watching and if you are new, do subscribe. If you already subscribed, keep watching. See you next time. Bye, Nara.